Well, g'day, everybody, and welcome back to Father's Frontier again. We've just had a new merchant turn up. A new merchant. What are they buying? What are they buying? Uh, he's paying a good price. for. He's actually paying a bloody good price for stone. All right. Let's transfer. Let's transfer 80, 80 stone across to there. Yes, indeed. Get that transferred across. We'll sell that to him because he's buying it at a good price. He's not buying uh, not buying herbs at a very good price, though, is he? Uh, <clears throat> well, I don't want to sell those, but he's, he's, he's selling those. We could do honey, you know. I've seen a couple of merchants that kind of like honey. So that might, I mean, that might be a, that might be a good idea. Uh, let's sell 83 of those to him. No, 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 no. No. We'll have to wait until that's, uh, we'll have to wait until that's all been transported. Hopefully it'll get transported pretty soon. Uh, let's see. What are we doing, guys? What are we doing? Is that, uh, that is targeted? Yep. There's people out there doing that. Probably going to need to bite the bloody bullet soon and put some, put some, uh, some crops in my god what are we what are we doing uh, people wise uh we've got 10 laborers which is absolutely perfect we've got no builders building anything at the moment so our labor will drop down once that's been done these guys here they're running out of uh they're running out of hide i think and i reckon he's running out she's running out of meat or something i don't know uh, so we may need to, do we, oh no, actually, we did, we put another bloody hunter in, didn't we? We did put another hunting cabin in, so we should be doing all right, but I can't see any, can't see any animals around. I wonder where they're gone. They just, oh, here, there's, there's, there's some running around here, which is okay for that hunting cabin, but, which is okay for this one. Uh, which we might actually relocate that out to there a little bit. Uh, what about these ones, though? That's the... Oh, there is there is a shitload in there, isn't there? Okay, uh, they were just hidden. They were basically just hidden. There we go. Lovely. All right, we'll keep that going. Do your stuff. Do your stuff. Something just flicked past me in my studio. And I have no freaking idea what it was. Do we have... Uh, Oh, crap. Uh, we don't have those over yet. Let's sell seven of them. Let's sell seven to you. Transfer those items. Well, hopefully that will keep those going and they'll keep throwing them over there and we'll be able to uh, get some get some stuff happening. Oh, what, what was he selling? Is he selling anything worthwhile? He's selling... Cl oh, crap. Uh, yeah, let's accept them. Let's get some houses done. All right, that, that, that changes things. That changes things. Uh, let's build a temporary shelter, maybe? Or do we build some more houses? E we could build a temporary shelter that can be stocked with food and supplies, allowing workers that are far from their residence to work longer before returning home. Uh, that's probably not going to help us, actually, is it? Really? I don't think. So I'm not going to worry about that at the moment. Let's just build some bloody houses. Let's get these people in houses, shall we? Uh, we well, we're not going to get people in. Uh, we could get that one in. Let's go one. There. Let's go... One there. One there, shall we? And maybe throw one in there and one in there. All right, let's get those built. Because we've got people who don't... We've got, actually got like nearly 10 people who don't have houses, which is going to be a little bit of a problem. So hopefully they'll uh, they'll get these built really, really quickly. But shit's going down. Look at these people. They're all working, cutting through the graveyard. Walking over the top of our one lonely grave. <laughs> this is probably a better. It's probably still a better bloody start than than the uh, than, than my last playthrough. Anyway, so that's probably not too bad. So over here we've got uh, we've got the storehouse. 
we have the smokehouse and we've got the two fishing huts over here as well so this smokehouse is doing fish mainly so that's all right what's this villager is unhappy oh that's because they don't have a home uh how are we going on other resources uh like our gathering resources because i think we put a i think we put a gathering hut out here we did put it oh there's a bit of lightning we did put a gathering hut out here didn't we um uh, well they're, they're, they're doing all right uh homeless yeah we'll sort that out they've got a hide coat which is uh which is probably helpful for them all right, so once we start generating a little bit more, uh, yes, I know there's a housing shortage. That's why they're building houses, you dork. Uh, that's a that's a gatherer's, that's a forager's shack. We're going to have to relocate their foraging to somewhere else now. Actually, we could probably bring their foraging down to here for now. There we go, forage away, forage away. Uh, there's probably no foraging they can do there, although I would really like them to, I would really like them to forage that as well so we can keep making more baskets. I think the trader's left. Trader has left. I think, uh, we can probably throw some more fish in here as well, do you think? Do you think that'd be good? I mean, we've got, ooh, we've got shitloads of fish, but my God. I don't know. It's a little bit of a worry, to be honest. Um, I coats. All right, let's just keep it. Let's just keep it going as it's going. Uh, that is completely and utterly full in that storage. So we're probably going to need to do some more storage as well. Uh, this here is only going to take food, which it should do. Herbs. I don't know where the herbs rot. Do they? I'm not sure, I'm not sure, and uh, that's our wagon shop, which they're making wagons, which is helping us along, that's our cobbler shop, cobbling away with shoes, yeah, there's stuff there, that's the stockyard, uh, a lot of that stuff is going into, because we were going to put a fair bit over in the, in the trading shack as well, so... We could put another hunter out here too, couldn't we? I mean, that might be a, that might be the go, but uh, we do want to do our uh, our little farmland out here once we get uh, there. We go. We've got enough houses for everybody, so that's good. There we go. Uh, hunters, fishermen, foragers, grocers. Uh, I don't think we can do anything else. We've got nineteen people. You know, we could start. We could start doing our farm now. We could start doing our farm. Although I think we're doing all right. See, we don't have any raw fish. We've got smoked fish and we've got smoked meat, and we have no raw meat as well. So we probably need to work towards some other stuff there, which would be perfectly fine. That's our hunter. Where's our forager right there? Where are you foraging at the moment? Uh, you're probably still foraging over here. Yeah, no, change that. Um, uh, let's forage over here for now and get rid of all of this stuff, please. Because we need the food. Uh, there's no more willow left over there. There's herbs and stuff, which is all right. But I think fishing... Probably, I, I think fishing might be a really good industry. Like, if we fish, 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 and then we sell off a lot of fish, then that might actually be pr a pretty cool thing to do, mightn't it? I don't know why they're not collecting and gathering this, though. Um... <laughs> I didn't realize that willow was actually used in medicine as well. Hmm. Gather that. Maybe they can't get down there. I mean, we're, we're within, aren't we? We are. We, we're definitely within. Uh, three new villagers born, you horny bastards. Uh, what are these guys? Uh, they're a little bit off on water, so let's let's build ourselves a... Uh, let's just be... Let's just be proactive and build ourselves a... Another well over here to feed all of these guys. 
Uh, how far is our, our, our wells over there? So I think we might throw one there. And that should cover that. That'll fix that up. They should be happy little uh, Vegemites. Very happy little Vegemites. Cool. And then we need to start looking at the uh, possibility of, I mean, they're getting their basic needs. Uh, firewood. Well, see, we've got shitloads of firewood. So that should be right up. We do clothing, hide coat. Shoes were doing well. So these guys should almost be, well, we've got to get them up to there. Uh, basic well market town center so they're the desirability factors but i don't want to go into investing in uh i don't want to go into investing in stuff that's going to low on builders add more to ensure really well we've got four Okay, that's that's a, that's a little bit bizarre. Um, we really need to go into stuff that's actually going to help. Well, we need to we need to do our economy, and at the moment, our service, our compost yards, costing us minus four. Now, apparently, see now that market is doing that right, but uh, I think somebody was saying that putting in a second market doesn't does not help you uh, and does not increase your income but that market only has that area doesn't it of um of capture so or is that just no that's probably the area of influence so if we put another market in it'll give us better influence and the market doesn't really cost us anything either uh which i mean might be a it might be a good thing if we could find some uh if we could find some stuff that doesn't cost us too much see that costs us uh four a month Ooh. market gives us a big desirability hit but the market gives us a desirability hit better than <sighs> See, because we're building our houses out this way, I was wondering whether we do do that. That costs us 15 a month. That costs us 25 a month. Uh, festival pole costs us 150 to build, but doesn't cost us anything monthly. Rat catcher costs eight a month. Uh, the school costs us 150. Let's build a school. Let's get a school in here, shall we? Where are we going to put our school? Because it did want us to do that, and it is going to uh, it is going to help us productivity wise as well. So it may be worth perhaps putting in here, and then we can build that road down there, and that that fills the desirability of all of that. But it's also going to do. It's also going to do all of this area over here once we start expanding our housing over there as well. So, yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. And it costs us 150. But I, I, oh, I didn't check, did I? I didn't check. Let's have a look. Uh, skew. And now it doesn't cost us anything per month, so... I think that's a wise decision. What do you think? What do you guys think? We'll probably uh, build that out there a little bit as well. There we go. Lovely. Oh, she's a sprawling little. Uh, she's a sprawling little thing, isn't she? Run, peasants, run! We're going into winter. I think we've, we've got plenty of food to keep everybody going. And there's a village just stricken with worms. You dickhead. What are you doing? Warps, diet, happiness, uh, luxury 100%, clothes and shoes. Why are you missing clothes and shoes and spirituality? We might be able to, you know, we might actually be able to... Um, we might be able to afford to have... 
something in here, like a, uh, I, I know, I know, people are telling me not to, that costs you four a month. Oh, I did want to try and put it in there, I tried to leave a little gap there, but it's no bloody good. Oh, it doesn't really cover everything, does it? Um, well, that sucks. Actually, what we could do, could we... No, we can't. You dick. The market's in the way there. Um, I was thinking we might be able to... If we destroy a bit of this road here... We need to do some more exploring, too. We really need to keep exploring. Let's throw something out there. Let's throw some more exploration maybe out here somewhere. Out here somewhere. We might end up being able to sprawl right, right along this river as well. Don't think there's really anything else that we can do, is there? Alright. A little bit of winter exploration. And there's our school going up. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, shit. We need clay. <laughs> we need clay to build a school. And we don't have any clay. So, now we're going to need to uh, bite the bullet. And throw in a clay pit. Right there. Like that. Uh, let's have a look. So it's got to be right on top, doesn't it? Okay, let's throw it there. Let's throw it there. Let's throw a little bit of road in as well so that we've got a bit of road running to it, which will be there. No. Under minimum size obstructed by road. Huh. That's interesting. What if we go up there? And across to there. There we go. That's a little bit better. And we'll run that up to there as well. Alright, so we, <laughs> we're going to have to get some clay before we can finish building our school. That's alright. That's fine. That's fine. Um, I think we might... Oh, no. We're being raided. Oh, crap. Oh, there's a there's a, a bunch of uh, wankers up there. Alright, okay, cool. Um, we've uncovered that. That was probably bad exploration, Simi. Bad exploration. Where's the bell? There. Let's get everybody in here. I don't know whether these raiders are going to follow him. So there's going to be a village up there that we're going to have to go and get rid of once we have a military by the looks of it. Doesn't look like they Ah, uh, yeah, they are coming. Okay, cool. Uh, let's grab everybody. Let's grab all of our townsfolk. Let's run them to here. Where are these where are these guys coming in? These raiders. I can hear somebody. Where are ya? I don't know where they've gone. I have no idea. Maybe they ran back again. Oh, is this them? No. Hmm. Okay, I was going to send my hot. I was going to send my entire village out to attack them. Well, that's a bit of a bugger. A raider encampment. We're going to have to... Oh, crap. Alright, so now we're going to have to start doing shit. Oh. Uh, 
Like, can we just get everybody just to go back to go back to normal again now? When we got somebody in there who has oh yeah, sick villagers. All right, so we're going to have to do some defense on this side of town, most definitely. That's going to be a big thing to do, but we're not going to do that now. <laughs> I hope you guys have really enjoyed this episode. Uh, I think what we'll do is we'll have this camp up and running, which we do have, which is fantastic. Do we have anybody working in there? Uh, yeah, we've got a couple of people working in there. And uh, and then we'll get uh, we'll get some we'll gather some clay so that we can finish building the um, so we can finish building the school which will be fantastic. Thanks everybody. See you next time. Bye.